All right, Dave and Jeremy back with another Saturday slap in the face. That's right, guys. We are in Singapore, Southeast Asia. We arrived this morning after 22 hours of flying, and we've Ooh. already been on several snakes. We found four today, including a really cool Waggler's Pit Viper, which is right to my left. Let's check it out. Nature in your face! All right, so right here is this amazing cryptic camouflage of this young female waggler's pit viper sitting in an ambush position away from people and waiting for something to come down this branch. Now, Dave, yeah. I want you to act like you're walking down this trail All right. with your hand on the rope, which we just saw a German couple running their hand down this rope. And right down here is something incredibly dangerous. Dave, go ahead and tell them what we're about to see. Yeah, so at the same time that Jeremy found that one in the tree, I spotted one coiled up on the rope, so I knew it was there, and I saw those two German people walking with their hands on the rope. I ran back here to warn them, don't put your hands on the rope. Do you? You're about to get a really, really, really bad bite. Yeah, so look at this. See if you can see when you see the snake. If you're walking, running your hand along the rope, Whoa. bam, look at right that. there. What's interesting is Jeremy mentioned the color. Now, the males and the females look very, very similar when they're neonates and uh, juveniles, it's not until they get a little bit older that the females become solid black and yellow. They got gold and black bands, they're beautiful. Now the, the males will retain the green coloration and have these red chevrons running along the back. So it can be confusing when they're younger, but you can already see the black and yellow on the head and on the sides of the body. So we know right away this is a female. We have not found a male yet. That's one of our main targets today. So we're gonna keep on looking for these guys until we find one of those green males. But we've seen so many people. What was crazy is we were actually photographing the snake and we had our gear sitting right here. And this guy went around us and I think his hand brushed against this waggler's pit viper. So that says two things. One, this could be a super dangerous situation. But number two, I mean, it didn't strike, it didn't even move. So it's waiting for smaller rodent to come running down here. All right, so Dave just had a good idea that we're gonna go let one of the rangers know and they're, I don't know, about 50 yards away from us and we're gonna let them know that the snake is sitting here so they can come move it because it is illegal, yep. right, to mess with anything in here and so we're not gonna handle this snake but it needs to be moved so no one gets bit. All right, hey guys, hope you enjoyed that Saturday slap in the face. We'll be doing a lot of filming and more herbs, so. Get and ready, get ready for some nature. In your face. Mm -mm.